Oh fuck! What up is Cam and welcome to a horror game called Homebody. This game has just come out. Um, I have no idea what it's about. I hadn't even seen a trailer or reviews about this game. Um, I was going through the store, found this random game. It came out today. I was like, why not? It's a horror adventure puzzle game. You know, it's right up my alley. So I hope it's good. I have no idea if it's going to be good or not. So I'm going right into this game blind. So yeah. Uh, Let's get on with the old video. I try to black out my room as well as much, so like I can try and get like the horror game sort of vibe. Got my red LEDs on, you know, because like to make me get as scary as possible. Um, it doesn't doesn't help though because um, it's absolutely scalding outside today. I went out earlier and it's like stepping into a furnace. It's unbelievable. Everything was burning. It's horrible. The UK is not, I'm not used to, I'm not used to that weather, I'm used to rain, cloud, overcast, wind, everything that gives me hypothermia, but no, it's like being in Spain. Tell what? What did it just tell me to do? Oh, okay, I'm actually playing now. Oh, that was a quick intro. It said to tilt something, but I don't know what I'm tilting. Where am I? Oh, it's a dream. No. 26 unread. Read your messages, woman! Typical woman. You send a message, they never open them or reply. Hey Emily, you're not giving up already, are you? Yes, I mean no. I'm on my way there, kinda. Are you panicking? Do you need to pull over? I I'm, I'm already pulled over. I already did. I'm at the side of the road. I'm trying not to. I don't think I can do this. I can do what? Already did. I'm at the side of the road. Already did what? Panicked or pulled over? Pulled over. I've got 26 unread messages from my friends and I know it's going to be bad news. I've been sitting at the side of the road for 20 minutes, just trying to stay calm. What happened? I don't, I don't think I can handle it. I'm thinking about turning around. Turning around to where? And you were hoping I'd give you permission. I would like permission to turn around, yes. Look, you're not going to, you're not going to a funeral. You go into a cool old house to hang out with your, our friends and watch a meteor shower. Do you think every year and you always seem to have a good time? First things first. Hands on wheel, key in ignition, start driving. <laughs> Simple as. Okay. There we go. Oh, but she said the exact same thing. <laughs> Excellent. So we're going to an old house for some meteor shower. Lovely. Why are we going to an old house then? Oh, you're on the phone while driving and your hands are clipping through the steel wheel. <laughs> Don't know if you drive like that, Emily. What are you so afraid of? Wait, is this the old house? It's a nice house. It's got a gate and everything. You can recall the important facts from your memory log. Press the menu button to open your memory log. Ah. Pull back if you see this. We're going to the down the road. Sorry if we miss you. The gate combination is in the third number down on the post on the post at C soon. Combination is in the th is in the third number down on the post post -it. Third number down. Okay. So you've got eight one. Two, nine. Here we go. 
This isn't a creepy house. She was making out that it was an abandoned, old, creepy, run-down house. But it's lovely. This is nice. I think Emily's just a paranoid woman, I think. I'm pretty sure it's just one of her friends and not some mad woman. Hi! How are you? Oh, hey Cliff. He doesn't seem too happy. Ooh. There she is, the star of the show. You're finally here. Yeah, long drive, huh? It wasn't that bad. I think, I think all in all, it was like three and a half hours. Felt more like six from here. We were getting worried about you. Were you though? Oh, I gotta tell a lie. Can't tell the truth. I got delayed by a work thing. That just means you're lying anyway. My mum held me up. No, I ran into car trouble. I mean, I almost ran out of gas on the way over. I had to go, to go way out of the way to find gas station. Don't be too embarrassed, Em. I, I forgot to turn on the headlights on the way out last night. My brain was just like, I can't, I usually see better than this. He actually said that out loud. And hey, I take it you got my text message. Yeah, sure. I totally read them. Cool, we were worried you wouldn't be able to get inside. Did Pete have any trouble getting here? Actually, Pete isn't here yet. Ah, ha, ha. He's dead. Pete's dead. He's about 33 hours late. Yeah. He was supposed to be here last night. He's dead. Worst of all, the owner of the house didn't want to tell us in before everyone named on the rental was here. Yeah, like a server at Oliver Garden not wanting to seat us until all until our whole party has arrived. Right. It took some convincing for him to let us stay. Is that Mr. Nest gave us an hour of instruct of instructions on how not to wreck the place. I think he would have done that earlier. I don't think he would have done that either way. He didn't strike me as a kind of guy who gets a lot of company. Not to be mean. Was that too mean? You're fine. Anyway, come on in, Emily. Make yourself comfortable. For real, you've got some catching up to do. How long has it been since I last saw you? Like a year? Yeah, don't keep us waiting any longer. Hey, why don't I take your bag for you? Well, thank you. So, Pete isn't here yet, because he's dead. Hey, everybody's really happy to, s to have you here. Are they, though? Are they, though? I am, too. Are they, though? Are they really? We're just telling me lies. This is a good game so far, I'm quite enjoying this. So like, I don't really know much about it. All I know is like, your past haunts you or something. You can use the interactive re reveal button to show interactive objects in the environment. Hold the left bumper to highlight everything nearby that can be interacted with you. Left bumper. Ah. Look at clock. Okay. So it's quarter past seven. Oh, no, 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 we leave that on. I think we leave that on. I want to check upstairs. Squeaky stairs. That's a good sign. Oh, the way she opened that door. <laughs> oh. 
She like broke her arm to open it. Examine bookshelf. One of the boxes missing from the from an otherwise full bookshelf. Hello! Francine! Hi! So Francine, I'm here. Oh hey Emily. Glad you could make it. Your room's down the hall. Oh nice. Yeah. Sorry I'm so late. My mum's really been She hasn't though, has she? No need to apologize. Well thanks for putting this whole thing together. Again. No problem. Hope you've been well. I've been good. Really busy, just non-stop working. Seems like it's been paying off. I saw Palmerton at Borders. Congrats. Thanks. My third grade art teacher started writing books for her grandkids and needed someone to draw them. And we had we had kept it in, in touch online so I can uh, look into it. How nice. That's very sweet. And I've done some add stuff too. It's weird to run across some of it in the wild. I'll bet. What else are you up to? I mostly just work. I like doing it. Hey, if it makes you happy. It does. <laughs> Since you're here, have you heard the house rules yet? House rules? Yes, the owner of the house likes it to be organised a certain way. The owner of the house left us a big bind of rules. We had to follow their pretty basic side from some weirdly specific rules about silverware. The broad takeaway is that we're not supposed to go into the cellar or attic. I really don't want to lose my part of the, of the deposit. I'm not here to rock any boats. Great to hear. There's a bed, mat, a bed made up for you in the little bedroom by the study. Take your time unpacking though. We're not going to be up to anything for a while so you can get settled in. That scene has been a while. It has. Can we just get on with the fucking story? <laughs> Yeah, Emily, I think it's that that's the time. Emily, you should stop talking! Finally going very a bit better with everything. Oh, for fuck's sake! Emily's a fucking talker! Oh my god. Right, let's get through all this. We don't fucking get. Emily, stop fucking talking, you fucking bitch! Oh my god. Emily can talk for days. My god. Oh, this is her room. Oh, that's a nice little picture. What's that noise? This sounds really loud. Oh, hi! I'm not gonna bother talking to you because Emily's gonna talk for fucking days. Oh. This is a creepy hallway. Bathroom. That's a weird here system. It's a chair in the bathtub. Classy. Oh, the soap. Someone dropped the soap. <laughs> Who was it? I bet it was Pete. Because Pete's no longer here. Is this my oh. <laughs> I love the way she opens fucking doors in this game, it's great. My car! Oh wait, what's that? Parker, thank you for the vi vials. I swear these are the last I'll need. Do you do remember to change your bandages because I do not plan on taking you to the ER again. The work will be done soon. Rest assured, it has convolted as you as you feared. Whoa, I just did a massive loop. 
Is it tough? Oh no, this is the garage. Okay. Check the bikes. I do not know the code. It's for that. Okay, let's just go and find our room. Um, get up the back and stairs. Hello. That's not creepy at all. Oh, 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 oh. Why is she just standing like that? Creepy bitch. You're the one who's gonna kill everyone here, isn't it? Yeah, I already know who the killer is. Game over. She's sus. <gasps> donuts. Can I not have donuts? I want donuts! I want donuts. God, it's, God, it's ten past nine. It's past my bedtime. Where is my room, anyway? And wasn't it down the hall? Oh, fuck! I'm fine. Oh, the power's gone out. Gary. Emily, what is going on around here? Everything's gonna be okay. You know that makes me feel worse somehow. That lightning was intense. That was a type of noise that makes people cartoonishly hit their heads. We're lucky no none of us got stri uh, stricken with amnesia. And it's not even raining out. Yeah, I noticed that too. Some kind of electrical storm, maybe. What's the plan for tonight? I don't know. I guess we need to figure out how, how the power situation. Cliff has been in the in the kitchen for like an hour working on dinner. He's probably pissed that the power's out. Do you know what to do about the, po the power outage? Hell, we don't have any notes on what to do if the power's out. You should talk to Cliff about it. About it, he knows his stuff when it comes to electrical issues. I just want to speak to Cliff. Oh, Clifford! Oh my God, she is she is creepy. I'm telling you, she's fucking scary. Oh, Clifford, my man. Is this Cliff? There be years. Cliff. Oh, hey. Who are you again? Ouch. That fucking hurt. You're looking at me like I know you. Who, um... I don't think you do. Wait, oh. Huh? Cliff, hey. Go away. But you know me. Go away. Okay, Cliff is a mean hide. Why is that an option? Why is that an option now? Can someone explain to me why hiding is an option right now? Right, so if Cliff is not going to help me, I guess I'm going to do it myself. What is... Mind that the fluid in this tank is a source of for all pumps in the house. Note, when importantly uh, calibrated pumps positioned above, this tank will drain automatically with gravity. For pumps positioned below, manually drain with be necessary using this button. Should I press it? Okay. And it does. Ah! Power box! Great. 
The strange power box mounted into the wall, it looks like it can be it can provide power to one of the two cables. That leaves the box on the left and the right side, but the box itself needs to be powered on first. There's a yellow and black stripped cable coming into the box into the bottom of the box from the other floor. The other cable leads from the okay. So I need to follow this cable, yeah? But it leads down into the floor. Wait, whoa, we've got a console. Oh, let's play some Mario Kart on it. I can't mind now because the power's out, but we will. I found the downstairs. I didn't even know you were allowed to go down here. Oh, I don't think I'm meant to be down here. Okay. Ah, here it is. What is that noise? Right, check machine. Ah, oh, God. I don't know. Oh fuck! What the fuck? What the hell? Run! Can I not run? Um, 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 um. What the hell? Where the hell did this person come from? Get upstairs, get upstairs, get upstairs, get upstairs, get upstairs, get upstairs. Get upstairs, get upstairs. No. No. Wait, where is everyone? Oh my god. Where is everyone? Why is there no one here? Oh my god, they're all dead. I need to hide. Where can I hide? Where can I hide? Oh my god, they're all fucking dead. They're all dead! Wait, is everyone dead? Oh my god, I saw it downstairs. I saw it downstairs. Oh my god, everyone's dead. I need to hide, I need to hide, I need to hide, I need to hide, I need to hide. Oh my god, no, not in here. Oh my god, no! 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 Is there somewhere I can go to hide? Oh, I'm dead. It's really hard to like move when you go into like a room because like if you get what I mean it's like a bit hard to keep on walking straight. Oh my god, that was intense. How did everyone just die? So I would have like heard a uh, walk I was sort of heard screaming. Well, the power's back on anyway. Okay, guys. Um, I think I'm going to call it there. I'm going to call it there. I know it wasn't much me playing, but I have got some stuff to do today. But this game's great. I love it. Like, I need to try and find out how to get the power back on and how to, like, unlock all these doors and everything. But that was crazy. How, like, how everyone just died. Like, everyone in the house just got stabbed. I mean, Cliff... I mean, Cliff is an asshole anyway. I don't really care he died. You know, I would have done it anyway. That's mental. Okay, guys, if you guys want to see part two, make sure to like and subscribe. Um, <sighs> I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say about that. That, that caught me off guard so bad.
Bye-bye.